got you stuck on that. Holy shit. You're good. Ho, ho, ho. Keep going, keep going. There you go. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Adventure Boat. My name is Kelly. I'm Trevor. And today we are in Jerome, Arizona, which is basically a town built on the side of a mountain. Very cool, historic town. It's like <laughs> this. All the roads are very narrow. Uh, the buildings are old. I mean, it is a really cool town. Historic even. Historic, yep. yes. Old mining town. And it's also the start of our trail we're doing right now. Smiley Rock Trail. Yep, let's do it. That's my line. Yeah, I stole it. <laughs> right now we're at about 10.7 miles into our journey from Jerome. We've gone from a very well wide maintained forest service road to more of a single lane forest service road. I don't remember what it's called, but it's a really nice drive. Yeah, it's really nice. It goes around the uh, Woodshoot Wilderness area. So it's really cool. I mean, it's beautiful. A lot of uh, cattle, uh, old mines, and you can see Mount Humphreys in the distance. So yeah, it's really pretty. Yeah, it's beautiful. And I don't know, we're almost halfway. Right now we are 14.7 miles in and we're making our left turn onto the more challenging part of the trail right under the high high tension power lines. What are they called? High voltage power, power, power lines? Power lines. Yeah. The big ones. There's big ones. You'll yep. see it. It's very obvious. Yeah. And this is the actual Smiley Rock Trail. I guess the other ones are like a connection to make a loop uh, fr directly from Jerome. And uh, Smiley Rock Trail, this is when it's starting to get a little bit more difficult. But yeah, and we'll we're looking see. forward to it. It's been yeah. a beautiful drive so far. Yeah. But we're looking for a little challenge now. Let's, yeah, I want to put it in four wheel. Yeah, let's do this. Do it. I don't know what is the issue. The truck will not go in full wheel drive. It did the whole thing in two wheel drive. I'm actually very impressed it made it up, but uh, not happy with this truck right now. Not happy at all. Not happy at all. No. All right, Trev's turn. We've officially entered the wash of the Smiley Rock Trail, and this is where everything starts to get a lot more technical. That first hill climb was kind of the uh, initiating the whole movement of the uh, technical portion, and now that we're really into it, um, two-wheel drive's not cool to have to do in this. My truck is still not going on a four-wheel drive, so kind of stuck here, but I have a winch, and I have an anchor, so <laughs> we should be okay. We shall see. We shall see. E 
even though Kelly's rig is stuck in two-wheel drive, it's still making it on these uh, uneven, loose rock. So it's still pretty impressive what these trucks can do, even in two-wheel drive. Oh, I am super frustrated with my truck. Uh, it's not going on a four-wheel drive. Uh, we're going to get into some pretty technical portions of this trail. So um, I have tried everything to get it. I have stopped, turned it off, turned it back on, neutral, park, every which way to get in full wheel drive. It's just not going. The full wheel drive indicator light just keeps blinking. This electronic full wheel drive transfer case is just terrible. Like I hate it. Um, so right now I'm actually going to pull the negative terminal on the battery and kind of just give the truck a hard reset, hoping that that kind of resets everything and gets this thing up and running. Ah! Well, that didn't work. Uh, it's making noises. It's doing some weird electrical. Uh, I want to work, but it's just not working. So I guess we're just gonna move on in two wheel drive and see how far we get. Down was easy, up not so much. Alright, this whole being in two-wheel drive thing is getting super old. I barely made it up that hill. I had to go down and then get a good little run up to it. I was yeah. kicking crap all over Trev, who was getting video. Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> yeah, it was... this, that was nothing in four-wheel drive, and it is a super challenge in two-wheel drive. So <laughs> definitely kind of over it. You know what? You should have brought the uh, Outback. Yeah. At least that yeah. has all-wheel drive. You should have brought the Land Cruiser. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Smiley Rock, just up ahead. On that. Back up just a little bit, try to bump. Right there, right there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Now we're doing rock stacking. Don't I feel like a noob? <laughs> Alright, I'll go get the anchor. I'm so not even close on that one. That? You were pretty close. It's kind of close. Keep winching. Oh my gosh, that's, 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 that's gonna tilt him. Uh, that's gonna tilt that, him. Okay, no, shouldn't it's he fine. move his tire? You sure? like, so it's, no, it's fine. That tire's off. Is that yeah. front rod's over the big tire? Oh I don't want to dig into that tire. No, it's getting the back up now. Okay. Let's see if I can go forward. Hey, hey winch all the way in. All right. I don't know why I'm holding up the window like I have to. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. 
super tilty. That makes me so nervous. Back it off. Keep going. Stop. Well, if that wasn't a lot of work for a little climb. What in the world? That's the best you got? How about some praise for the winch? <laughs> praise the winch gods. Iron Man 4x4 for the win. According to all trails, Smiley Rock is right off the left of the trail here, right around the 17 and a half mile mark. And we passed right by it apparently on all trails, but we have searched and searched and searched and we can't find Smiley Rock. So. Unless it's further ahead and we haven't gotten to it yet, Smiley Rock is not Smiley. The entire family is searching for Smiley Rock. <laughs> I see no smiles. I don't see any Smiley Rocks. All right, That's who it. found Smiley Rock? This girl did. <laughs> we found the crown jewel of the Smiley Rock Trail. Yep, the namesake, if you will. Yeah. And it's right there. Mm-hmm, right here. Yep. And it's definitely a Smiley Rock. Yeah, I thought it was uh, carved in there, but no, it's pretty natural looking. It doesn't look carved, so it's kind of cool. Yeah, I don't know. I th honestly, yeah, it looks like either uh, erosion or a big drill. One or the other. It's yeah, it's, it's <laughs> coin toss. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't look like drill, though. I don't know. But it is right off the trail at 18.28 miles from Jerome. And this trail is awesome. I yeah. love this trail. It's very beautiful. Now we have about four, five-ish miles till the end. And I hope there's not too many obstacles because I still don't have four-wheel drive. <laughs> 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 yeah, real funny. Hey, got to use my winch for the first time. Yay. Off a tree even. Yay, Yay. Iron Man. <laughs> we're breaking it in the right way. <laughs> All right, we're moving on. Do it. You're good. Slow, slow, slow. Hard. Okay, back up. Back. Stop. Driver. Come to me. Yeah. Slow, slow, slow. Just come straight. Right now we are on the part where we actually dip into the ravine, I guess it is. Yeah. And it is boulder some fields. big boulders in this. Yeah. And uh, this oh is not going to be fun with two wheel drive. So right now our plan is basically to try to a little far ahead. There's no trees in here for me to really winch off of. So I'm going to try to get as far as I can. I might have to winch off of him. And then we're kind of you know, sleep frog a little bit until we get through it. Let's get it done. All right. Straight, straight. I can't believe you made it over can't that. I can't believe I made that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's not even, that's not even a thing. <laughs> Stopped. They come driver. You're good. Driver. 
Yep, there you go. You know, for being a overland touring rigs, we seem to be rock crawling a lot. <laughs> it's a lifestyle, bro. It's a lifestyle. You got it. You're good, just go over it. Slow, slow, slow. There you go. Come to me. More. There you go. Slow, or you're going to come off a big on the uh, passenger side. Driver, there you go, right there. We have absolutely no idea how long this ravine goes for where we're kind of stuck in this big boulder field, but it's uh, it's gonna be a long way, I've got a feeling, because you, as far down as we've walked, it is like this, big, giant boulders. That Honestly, this is not a huge, this isn't a huge problem for Tress 4Runner. He's, he's doing this great. He's getting spotted, he's picking his way through, but he's in four low. Unfortunately, being a two-wheel drive, my gears, they, they want to slide out and only having rear traction. It's pretty terrible, but uh, picking our way through. You better make this. I don't want to back up. Oh, there's trees to winch. Oh, come on. Oh, so close. Because it's his, uh, the back tire. Whoa, oh boy. Driver, driver. Give gas, gas, gas. Keep going, keep going. There you go. Driver, driver, driver. Boom! Nailed it! Go, go, go! Oh, oh my god! I'm the best spotter ever! And now I'm stuck. <laughs> oh! On nothing! Having fun, bro? Nah. Uh, fun was 20 minutes ago at Smiley Rock. Now this is actual like hardcore work. <laughs> Not fun. A little, little bouncy? Yeah. I uh, really wish my truck would be, uh, you know, four wheel drive capable right now. Uh, a little upset by this whole scenario. Yeah, this is, should be a moderate trail. Yeah. And for you, it is becoming a hardcore trail. We'll need a winch one time, but I'm hoping to that will be the only one, so All right. we'll see. So I'm not sure if people have just lost the art of accurate trail descriptions 
But this trail is really, really good. I mean, look at behind me. I mean, all the trees are kind of grown over the trail. Yes, this is a very challenging section with all the big boulders, but if you have four wheel drive and some good clearance and some, uh, I don't know, 33s, this is not an issue. It's only an issue because of my two wheel drive problem. My uh, stupid Tacoma doesn't want to cooperate. However, this trail's fantastic. We are about three and a half, four miles to the end. And I mean, it's still going start to finish Starting in Jerome. I mean, how cool is this trail? I love it. So yeah, we're we're picking our way through and it's fun. This is a great trail. Everyone who's given this a bad rating, shame on you. Shame on you for not being accurate in your trail description because this trail is gorgeous. It's so bouncy. Easy peasy. Well, this is the last climb out of the big boulder field, ravine, wash, whatever you want to call it. And uh, it's a little tricky boulder right here in the middle of it, which is going to be super cool and two-wheel drive. But I'm um, going to give it a good run. We get a little momentum. We're going to get up with no problems, no drama whatsoever. What do you think? Was I convincing? <laughs> was I was I convincing it to uh, go into my peril? <laughs> I feel like you need to blast the karma gods. <laughs> That's not that's not how we bless karma oh. gods. Is it all? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I misjudged how close you were to it when I said cut driver. I thought you were further away. It cut right over it. Yeah, I figured it's not bad. No, like I think if like if you literally just stayed to the left. Right. Well, I think you're fine. I, I think that you had to go passenger and then cut driver, otherwise you'd hit that you know, potential yeah, hitting that yeah. tree, so. Muscles <laughs> all the time. Why not spend all of her fitness paychecks? It's cool. <laughs> So that was Smiley Rock Trail, and what a trail it was. I mean, super, super, like, ah, oh, that was just a cool trail. Yeah, it was really uh, beautiful um, being kind of in the high desert around Jerome, um, but then, like, just pine trees dropping into the canyon was absolutely beautiful. Uh, very bouncy trail. Yeah. Very yeah. bouncy. The Especially first... when you have two-wheel drive yeah, trying to get that through was it. Super fun. <laughs> so the first, what, 17-ish miles, yeah. it was just a really nice forest service road. And then right after the Smiley Rock itself at about 18 and a half, that's when it got really, really interesting with the uh, ravines and the uh, and the big boulders. It was definitely a challenge. Yeah, yeah. And, and there's nothing really difficult. It's not rock crawling. It's not anything like that. Whoa, whoa. It, it's a little bit rock crawling. It's a little bit. It's more like boulder hopping. Boulder hopping. Than anything else. <laughs> in a Tacoma, in yeah. a forerunner. Yeah, boulder yeah. hopping. It's, it, it is uh, just bouncy. Like, yeah. It's just bouncy. That's yeah. the only way to explain There's it. There's a few spots where you're going to have to get a spotter or, and yeah. just pick your line right and you'll be all right. Yeah. All right, for some trail logistics, right now we actually camped about a mile from 89A. So we're about a mile short of the end of the official trail, but we are at 22.28 uh, miles, about seven and a half hours of, you know, from start to finish. Uh, travel time was three hours and 45 minutes um, and got 2,700 feet of elevation gain. Yeah. And honestly, what I would do uh, if I were to do this again, I would start on the Smiley Rock Trail and end in Jerome because that'd be a, cool. A, a beer 
at one of their yeah. saloons sounds fantastic. Get right a little now. haunted hamburger and a, yes. and a beer. Yeah, that'd yeah be, that's... that would be smart. However, we did it this way, so we don't get that. No, we get no. It. bring what you brought. We have amazing <laughs> campsites. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, once again, thank you so much for watching. We really hope you enjoyed this really, really cool trail here outside of Jerome, Arizona. Remember, be sure to subscribe. It really does help Adventure Built grow. Hit that thumbs up button. Be sure to comment. We'd love to hear what you guys think of this trail. Also, follow us on Instagram. It's Adventure Built underscore. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.